listening to you speak, and I say this all the time, success, it's intentional. It's an intentional endeavor. Ah, how many hours does D of Sims work? I, I work around the clock. Yeah, realistically, I mean, I work, I work, I'm more intentional now since I've had a daughter mm -hmm. about like getting, dedicate time with her and like sleeping, you know, through the night, like six, seven hours. But I would say before then, we, I, we, we, you know, work all around. And I actually don't recommend that, right? So in the early days, like it was a, you know, I'm sure y'all all heard that like we don't sleep, sleep's the cousin of death. We all definitely lived in that, in that, in that whole movement. I would look at my phone for years and I could see where like you're texting at my Blackberry at the time. You could see you stop emailing at like 4.58 and then you pick it back up at seven, particularly in the roles that I had because it was on both sides. We have Puff and all the artists, they're up, they're up till like 6 a.m. in the studio, they don't right. start, but I still gotta be up for calls with Estee Lauder and Diageo and all of our corporate counterparts that start at 8 a.m. At some point, I gotta jump in the shower. You know what I mean? Like, so, so your days would really be 24 hours. Um, I actually, I think you guys are so fortunate, you don't have to work like that, right? Um, when you look at our, our grandparents or great-grandparents were spending all of their time, they were like literally churning butter, riding horse. Like you don't have to do any of that stuff. You got Google, you don't have to go to the encyclopedia. So you should be able to be more efficient with your time and you actually shouldn't have to grind the way we have so you can have whole and complete lives and travel and have deep relationships and still be a beast at what you do. I think success is not only intentional, it's also available for everybody, right? Like there's no bias, no zip code has a lock on genius. So I feel like don't think um, success is some uh, segregated, difficult place. It's available for all of you. Uh, it really, really is with the level of intentionality and consistency. And the real measure of success is legit being happy, right? And, and I will say, like some financial freedom, of course, can make that a little bit easier. I, I just, it really is available for you if you figure out what you want to do and focus <laughs> on it and dedicate the time to it. Um, I think something I see a lot is and shoot, I tell this to Puff too, he suffers for this himself. It's like you can, you can do anything, but you can't do everything, right? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. like, so it's like you can, I, I talk to a lot of young people who have so talented in so many different things, and I know it's a gig economy, but sometimes it's helpful to be ruthlessly focused on doing the hell out of one thing, first at least, um, and killing that, and that's where you meet success. Wow, <laughs> so many gems dropped. Whoa. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.